And for years, we have been reporting on the lack of affordable housing in Port Aransas and what that really means for people who work there. Well, many of them live in surrounding towns, leading to pricey and inconvenient commutes. Now the RTA is stepping in to help. Our Nikila Pradier is in the studio with the story. And Nikila, the RTA already serves Port A, but this new route will add some key stops. Yeah, Paulo, it will start here in Corpus Christi and then make stops in Ingleside and Aransas Pass on its way to Port Aransas. Business owners in Port A believe this is a huge help to their current employees and it could also bring some job seekers to their town. The problem isn't job availability in Port Aransas, it's finding people to come over and fill those jobs. Before the hurricane, we have struggled getting employees here and then the hurricane happened and last summer, I mean, we were short before we we're really short. At the longtime affordable housing shortage and Port A council member and business owner Beth Owen says there's one solution. What we really need is transportation. Well, a lot of times it felt like we were running our own taxi service. Chris Collins is general manager of several of Owen's businesses, including Finn's Grill and Ice House, and says it takes real effort and coordination to get employees to work. Everybody, you know, pitches in to try and pick somebody up here, pick somebody up there. So both Collins and Owens are excited about the RTA's new Port Aransas Express route with stops in Ingleside and Aransas Pass before going to Port A. We'll run from Corpus into those areas, run three times in those areas, then come back into Corpus. Collins thinks it will make a world of difference for employees. Now you've got a really affordable way to get to work, not put the wear and tear on your vehicle. You don't have to wait in the ferry line because the bus gets priority boarding, so you come straight across. And for those who want a job but didn't have a reliable way to get to Port A, the new route is a game changer. We have a lot of openings for jobs and a lot of a room for growth. It's a win-win situation for both the workers and the employers in the uh, Port Aransas area. And the route is only 75 cents each way. It starts tomorrow and will run seven days a week. And we're going to have a link to the route details and times on our website, ChrisTV.com. Paulo. Wow, less than $2. Well, for now, the Port Aransas Express route is a pilot program. It will run until at least Labor Day. If it's successful, the RTA will consider extending it.